Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is your boy Keenan Lambert and in this video we are in Bahia, Brazil, Salvador. We're gonna do a nightlife video. Let's do it again. Here we go. So the lit nightlight area is not actually out here. It's actually in Pellerino. We'll exhaust this and then we'll head over there. Without dragging this out, let me explain the reason for the title. Last night, standing in front of a club not too far away from here, I was asking some questions to a young lady. She didn't speak English, but she spoke Spanish, so we were fine. I wanted some information on a club before I went in. She explained to me that that club is very diverse in nature. She explained it could be concert-like, discoteca-like, or, or if interested, I could pick up some chicas for purchase. Y'all know that's not my thing. However, as I was speaking to her, I felt a light tug on my back right pocket. Too bad for them, I always carry everything in a money belt. I'll put the link to the money belt in the description box below. Yeah, in front, I'm a guy who loves live music. Actually, right off to the left is the location of the club that I was standing in front of, just to be clear. These ladies told me not to go to Pelarino, but for me, I just thought they were being classist. Boy, I'm about to learn. Let's switch vibe. We're going to Pelarino. Pelarino? Yeah, I think I said it right. Here we go. So, it looks nice enough here in Pellerino, but ain't shit going on. No, I think I might have to get the hell up out of here. We'll see. Yeah, this house looks like it's been here since the 1700s, but uh, I don't know. And, and nothing going on in the street tonight. Due to economic stagnation, you'll find a lot of folks from Salvador in other cities like Sao Paulo and Rio. You know, Something Pellerino is dangerous. Is it dangerous or is it just black? Let me give you some Salvador vibes from Rio de Janeiro. You're not ready for this Team Gringo stiff samba. And this is how it's supposed to look, courtesy of my future ex-wife. Of course, from a mile away, this brother can smell the gringo on me. He's telling me how he works for a community project that accepts donations for some of the homeless population here. Here on the streets in Pelarino and other parts of Salvador Bahia, you will see a lot of homeless people. The volumes of people sleeping in the street here in Salvador is heartbreaking. One. Primera vez? Sí, primera vez. Ah, la vida. Boa. La mía. 
After making it clear that this is my first time here in Salvador, this gentleman is trying to amp the trip and possibly profit off of our relationship that we just formed. I shall not dabble in street meat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 uh, See, this guy just, um, it's extorting the hell out of me. <laughs> wouldn't, wouldn't leave me alone until I gave him some money. There's some sort of project here that supports the tourism, I guess, and I don't know, he's a being a pain in the ass. So they told me Pellerino used to be dangerous. Wait, 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 wait. Who is this sister on the left? And why is she wearing a club dress barefoot in the streets outside the community restaurant and holding her baby on top of it? Gentlemen. No, no, no. You know what? Never mind. I'm not even going to ask. You know, bro, I just had to pull the plug on uh, this part of the video because uh, some guys told me I had to be careful with my camera because they might think I'm police. So I guess it's not safe. <laughs> people pulling on you, people looking at you funny. Yeah, since I didn't have a local cover in the area, I had to pull the plug on this part. Sorry, guys. You guys, I think that might have been the first time that I had to pull the plug on a segment of a video that I was doing. Um, just, it, was, it got too sketchy too quick. This guy is offering me chicas, this guy is bringing over his friend and saying, oh, you shouldn't film, be careful. It, it shit just got too weird too quick. <sighs> Yo, Salvador is different, boy. It's cool, it's cool vibe, but it's dutty. <laughs> it's well dutty. It's literally just a mere ten dollars for this big ass fish. I'm going to dig it. How many of you would have the stomach to eat after seeing them big old roaches? <laughs> anyway, despite this being a tourist city, there are deep culinary roots that lead back to Africa here. If you're interested, check the Salvador City video in the end screen for that one. I'm actually gonna change my shirt because in this I look like somebody's uncle who gets no buns. So let's change it up real quick. Hey, somebody come here. I'm gonna come. Hey. I'm gonna come. On. Yesterday I saw this kid and his dog sleeping on the beach. I'm happy I finally got a chance to give him a little something. I was expecting this place to be like a Brazilian Atlanta, but instead what I got was a Brazilian Baltimore from 20 years ago. Let me show you my Salvador Bahia apartment. Right here we have the bedroom. The bed is spread horribly. My mom is gonna hate that part of the video. Then we have the bathroom. Right. Great water pressure on that shower, just so you know. All right, let's go into the living room area. Okay, living room area, you got your kitchen table right here. Okay, got these on them. All right, this is your kitchen area. Okay, got your microwave. What is this? This is maybe a press of some sort. Your stove for those of you who like to cook. And then we got outside. Well, it's dark now, but let's fix that real quick. For those of you who want to go to Bahia, I'll put the link for this place or exact replicas of this place in the description box below. 
when you're ending the night here in Brazil, there's only one way to do it. You got to do it with uh, some ice cream or acai, I believe they call it. I don't know if that's the flavor, but that's the name of like the uh, gelato or whatever. Anyway, we're ending with cold stuff. It's kind of like ice cream or icy. Adios. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Love you guys. See you. Samba é paixão, renova a alma, vem do coração.